Good morning from Anaheim. Uh, where? What should I explain about last night? Last night was um. Well, last night I did this. I washed my clothes in the tub, and I was thinking if I hang dried them, they would be dry. Everything is still wet. Like these are super damp. This is the driest one because it's not 100% cotton. Um, all these other cotton shirts are completely soaked. These pants are still soaked. My comfy like sweats shorts are soaked. Um, this shirt, this is actually the driest one. I think I'll wear this today. Uh, still wearing boxers. <laughs> these shorts are soaked. These socks are still wet. Um, I've been uploading. I had a peanut butter sandwich for breakfast. Um, I got this thing charged up for today because I'm going to be walking around with it. Um, what else? What else? I've been using this uh, hotspot device. That's been insane. Um, I've actually been connecting my cell phone to it as well uh, to save on, well, if it's unlimited, why not? <laughs> you know. Um, anyways, uh, I'm going to pack up and head in the bus over to VidCon. I don't know what my plans are for tonight as far as like hotel, whatever, but I just felt so gross yesterday and so sweaty and that was my only pair of shorts with a belt, which clearly I can't wear today. But I'm going to put everything on the roof and dry it out while I'm inside networking. Uh, There's a half an hour before class starts, so I got to hit the road. So I got uh, two pairs of pants drying right there. I got my shorts. I got all my shirts in the back drying. This is by far, I don't know, one of the smelliest uh, clothes wash uh, experiences I've ever had. The wet clothes picked up the smell of the smoky Motel 6 room, and the clothes smell like they need to be rewashed. Absolutely disgusting. No offense to you smokers. Kind of really day one because yesterday I didn't know there was no classes or anything. But I'm over here networking. And please tell me about your channel and your channel name. I'm Heather Justine. Um, I do vlogs too, not daily, like three times a week, but I'm vlogging my entrepreneurial journey. I'm going to I quit my job in marketing and communications in your career, and I'm trying to start a movement to promote digital literacy. This is the reason I came. Uh, something like this is a networking room, if you can hear me. Look at everybody trying to make friends. Another cool person over at VidCon. Hello. He's got, please tell everybody what your product is about because I have to share with everybody. Cool. So, like, we use virtual reality to help people make animations, especially those people who don't know how to do animations. So, you put on a headset and you get to, like, be an avatar and you know, an alien or a cartoon character. That's cool. Super fun. And in a really small form factor, and if you could show that little uh, behind the scenes picture, yeah. it's insane. And basically, what people can do, if there's any animators um, out there or, you know, voiceover people, l look what you can do. Like with a couple little things in your hand and a headset, you can have your own, like, cartoon. It's so cool. Yeah. So, thanks. Very thanks nice meeting sharing. you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah man. Cool. Yeah. You're up. All right, so a little bit like Wedding Crashers, uh, I did crash a women's group of uh, networking. And you brought which, me too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because I didn't want to come in here and promote myself, but I would love to promote any ladies who I bump into on my travels. Uh, travel blogger, food blogger, food and travel, food and travel. All, and, all, of all the above. DIY, perfect. So. There's no reason not to include ladies on my trip and let people know if there are any ladies out there that want to live the van life. It is a possibility. So we're actually going to get a little, um, we're, we're going to get a lesson from this man right here. Please say your channel. My channel, um, my channel, no, I don't want Cali, that's my channel. <laughs> so he, he does um, travel vlogs and stuff like that. He's going to hook 
everyone up with some info on how to make money on YouTube right now. So this is gonna be some good info. I'm just across the street from all the action over there. And I met the Jurgies. What's, What's going up? on? We're his new best friends. Yeah, that's yeah. right, new best friends. Yeah, we're traveling <laughs> with them every day now. <laughs> so you know what's funny is that I've been walking through and handing out business cards and stuff like that. And you're not really like hard selling myself, but just being like, hey, this is who I am, this is what I'm doing. A lot of people, including these guys, are like, you guys are living my dream. <laughs> I want to buy a school bus. It's so we walked over good. here to give a nice little tour to these guys. Yeah, I'm yeah we're pumped. So better not let us down. I just noticed you have grass on the roof. Yes. What? That is awesome. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, there's grass on the roof. And did so you guys bring your putting uh, equipment? Your uh, golf yeah, clubs? I, I brought my putting yeah. skills. So. <laughs> Like yeah, it. let's let's do a tour right now. Yeah. Okay, sweet. cool. Oh, and um, I told the clothes are still drying in there, and they smell like smoke. And I, I, I was like, <laughs> man, I should have cleaned this thing again. Fail number two. Hey, you're talking to us too. We went up the Pacific Coast in what was our car? A Corolla. Oh, we wore the same clothes every day. For and we like slept six in it weeks, for so. a little while. So, <laughs> so just gave a, a little tour on the inside to these guys. Now I must ask you. After seeing the bus, after learning about the bus a bit, we'll buy it. <laughs> <laughs> on a scale of one to ten, how likely are you to purchase a bus I'm in the future? I'm like an 18 right now. That's what I'm feeling. Damn. What about you? <laughs> yeah, that's same. We just need to if it, if we, we figure out the bus. way, the means to do it, we're doing it. Mm -hmm. Like it's even like it. for our travels, and then even the hat. I feel like every family should even have one of these. Like seriously though. Totally. Like, yeah. uh, yeah. Oh, I love it. Look at those yeah. little, like, bronze pattern. <laughs> it's funny because it used to, it used to be, it used to be black and it faded. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. I actually prefer the color of it. So. Wait. I have a name for the lawn. What is it? It's called Milan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, I'm a tacos. Ready? You guys are nuts. Okay. Oh my God. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you won't. That you can actually stack a bus on top of a bus. That's how strong they are. Really? Yeah. See, and they're safe to drive. Yeah. Sure. Well, if you think about it... rules? Oh, yeah. go ahead. I was just going to say, if you think about it, they're made to transport children. That's if something goes true. wrong, huge lawsuit. That's true. Buses are way, 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 way sturdier than RVs. <laughs> We gave a little uh, tour to the jerkies. Yeah, yeah. Thanks forever. Thanks I feel forever. like I made new friends for life. Yeah. Honestly, yeah. Seriously, like no BS. Like no. seriously, you guys are so cool like, and so nice. There's fake friends online, but these are this is real. I just came for his ice cream, <laughs> which they which kindly is... declined. Actually, yeah. <laughs> I, I felt like uh, I don't know if I mentioned this, but I think I have. I need to eat healthier. Of course, the first thing I do and get in the bus, I'm like ice cream. It's so, hot though. Really it's good. super hot out here. <laughs> it's really hot. Yeah, especially those like Haagen Dazs ones with like the oh, chocolate yeah. on the yeah. stick. Like, yeah. man, those are good. So, okay, actually, that was the only thing I've <laughs> eaten all day. Really? Oh, really? Yeah. We uh, so we got into our Airbnb yesterday, and I was checking the freezer. Ice cream sandwiches in there. It was awesome. Yum. I was like, I was like, this is the best Airbnb so far. <laughs> it's funny how the little things can make yeah. a big difference, you know? Yeah. yeah. Guys, we are back at the bus. Um, it kind of seems like a, a bus tour kind of day <laughs> in a different kind of way. But I want to introduce you to Hi. one of my friends. This is Kennedy. Nice to meet you. <laughs> okay, and what's the channel so everybody knows? Uh, Kennedy Zimmet, Z-I-M-E-T. Cool. And Kennedy and I met several years ago at um, a workshop and all that stuff. And we've been keeping in touch with each other. And I don't remember. I think the last time I saw you was in Studio City two for lunch. Years ago, maybe? It must have been two years yeah. ago. It's been a while, but um, she's here, I'm here. So she wanted to see the bus. And of course, I wanted to show her the bus. Excited. Oh, well, thanks. Yeah. Oh. oh, my VidCon. <laughs> I am absurdly wiped out. Also, I'm not inside Dandy Adventure Bus anymore. I'm inside another cheap motel. Happens to be the same motel I was in last night, different room, and guess what guys? It doesn't smell like cigarettes. This is a non-smoking room. Non-smoking. I don't know why they have an ashtray, but it's non-smoking. I wonder if it says, no, it's not. Yeah. Non-smoking. 
my goodness gracious oh so today today was all about networking um the way that this channel is going to build is by making friends with people authentic friendships not fake friendships you know like if someone has an interest in something that i am also interested in um perhaps i could pick them up and we go on a trip someplace or something like that you know what i mean so um my channel has grown the fastest with uh collaborations and so that is definitely the way to go for me um and if i didn't have a shrinking bank account i probably wouldn't be so um you know maybe focused but i got a fire under my ass <laughs> and it's burning and it says succeed or get a job by 2018 so here i am i am in anaheim just being myself walking out to people saying hello asking them what they do um telling about myself and if it's a good fit, you know, it's like, this is, this is where people come to, to network and stuff. So um, that's why I'm here. I just want to thank everybody who I met today <laughs> um, for an amazing day. It was a lot of fun. Um, it's really cool to meet other people who also talk to their right hand. <laughs> it is. It makes me feel a little bit more normal. And it makes me feel... Um, yeah, part of like a larger community, which is pretty cool because everybody likes to share things at this event. Everybody likes to share something about themselves or their interests or what they're good at or their aspirations. And so, yeah, it's fun. So um, I'm going <laughs> to say goodbye for tonight. I'm exhausted. It's time for a shower. And it's time to relax. If I can go to sleep early, maybe I'll edit two more videos tomorrow morning. I don't have to be there until like noon or something like that for another networking thing. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys tomorrow.